Welcome to our tutorial on recording MIDI. We're going to pick up where we left off in our previous tutorial where we'd added my keyboard and an instrument track for monitoring the signal. In this tutorial, we'll record from your external MIDI device and play it back. First, let's make sure the record enable and monitor buttons on the new instrument track are on. If your levels sound low, click the edit instrument button and then drag up the return gain slider. Let's close this and now we're ready to record. Press record. My pre-click start. Press stop when you're done. Here is our recorded MIDI data. We can edit it note by note with a double click. This opens up the key editor, a topic we'll be covering later in this course. Now let's have a listen. Disable the monitor button, return the cursor to zero, and press play. The playback is then routed through my Triton. Press stop when you're done. Now be sure to save your work. MIDI data is stored right in the project file. One additional note, you can't use the same input ports for audio input buses and for the return bus on an instrument track. So if you've got a shortage of input ports, you can record and monitor MIDI with a regular MIDI track and an audio track that's receiving input from your external device. Let me configure that setup. You can also record the audio signal at the same time if you like. This concludes our tutorial on recording MIDI.